Hey everyone, welcome to Tips for Supporting Survivors. I actually want to make this about you. It's the start of the new year. Welcome back to the channel. You know, sometimes when you're trying to support a survivor who struggles and has post-traumatic stress disorder or complex post-traumatic stress disorder, which a lot of us have, uh, can be really exhausting and really tough for you guys that genuinely care and love us. So my tip to start the year is actually all about you. I just, I want you to check in with you. How are you? Are you feeling depleted? Are you feeling like you could do with some help? Please listen to the inner voice or your instinct around this. You can't give from an empty cup. And when you're trying to support survivors, that can be really challenging. And although you want to keep going, and bless your little heart that you do, you actually do need to put yourself first some of that time. Get that break, have that rest, do what you need to, so you can come back with even more to offer. You're special, you're a key part of your survivor's recovery and how do I know this to be true because you're watching this so love and light to you beautiful supporters out there we wouldn't be much without your love